What's up, Pisces? It's Ashley here, Fire Intuition. I am here to do your mini case of the X reading. So let's see what the X is up to. Let's see how the X feels. And let's see if they want to get back together. This will be for your sun, moon, rising, also Venus, September 20th through October the 1st. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe, Pisces. Messages for the sign of Pisces and love, September 20th to October the 1st. How does it guys feel when it comes to the sign of Pisces? Alright Pisces, let's see what we got for you. So when it comes to the ex and what they are up to, we have the Five of Swords, we have the Chariot, we have the High Priestess, so you're in their energy, Pisces. Pisces, some of you guys could have been dealing with another Pisces. We do have Cancer um, energy here. We have the Chariot. So what the, what the ex is up to is like, I feel like they're walking away from the past, okay, with this Five of Swords, wanting to move forward. But we do have the High Priestess here, so something was hidden, or they're thinking or looking at something totally different. Why is the high priestess here? We have the ten of swords. So there could have been a lot of deception and betrayal in the past. I feel like the ex was keeping a lot of secrets, okay, with the high priestess here that stopped you guys from moving forward with the chariot. And it's like this person wants to come out of this energy with you because we have the five of swords. They're letting go of the past. They know they put you in a difficult situation or, you know, they betrayed you. They backstabbed you. And they're wanting to come out of that energy um, why is the five of swords here? Yeah, we have the page of swords. Yeah, they definitely were keeping secrets. They were lying to you. Okay, so whoever you guys were with, it could have been an air sign because I have a lot of air energy here, but they just weren't honest. And this person is definitely like spying on you right now, seeing what you're up to. You know, they're trying to figure out if someone new is in your life. We have the page of swords. Someone's not letting go of the past. Because I feel like one of you guys walked away, but the other person is still like, you know, the, the relationship's over, but the other person is still kind of like spying, maybe seeing what you're up to. We do have the chariot. They want to know if you moved on. Some of you guys are dealing with a cancer for sure. Yes, yeah, they want to know if you guys moved on. Five of cups. Part of them wants to reconcile the relationship. I feel like they strongly do, but because they did so much in the past or they hurt you so bad, they don't feel like you think the same we have lots of five of cups here, the ace of cups and the king of wands. Some of you guys are dealing with an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius that wants to offer you a new beginning in love. The king of wands could be anyone. For some of you guys, Pisces, you're the only case of the X reading that I've picked up so far where I feel like this is, or this is new love. For some of you guys, you have someone new. It could be any sign, king of wands, that wants to offer you a new beginning in love. Yeah. This can be your ex, or for some of you guys, this is new love coming in. And I feel like that's why the ex is spying Page of Swords, because they know that someone new is around you, or they feel like someone new is around you. So just, you know, being nosy. But I definitely feel like what the ex is up to, they're spying on you, seeing if you're still stuck in the past, wanting to reconcile, wanting to come out of something difficult with you, seeing if you have new love in your life or not, or wanting to offer you a new beginning in love, where they're taking, you know, taking action, okay? Um... So how do they feel about you? We have the Nine of Wands. We have the Ten of Pentacles. We have the Knight of Cups. Yeah, they want some type of reconciliation, Knight of Cups. The thing is that we have this Nine of Wands, so they still feel like, you know, that you're defensive, that you're going to go off, you know, kind of mad, upset about what has happened. Oh, yeah, so we have the Devil. Some of you guys are dealing with a Capricorn. They feel like you're still mad about the things that did happen in the past with the devil and the nine of wands. But they do still want to keep the relationship or, you know, I feel like with the ten of pentacles, whatever you guys had, they want that back. Because we do have the nine of cups. They do want to reconcile the relationship. They also want to come in with an apology. Why is the ten of pentacles here? Yeah, see, they want some type of new beginning. They want to start over. They want some new beginning. They want to rebuild or they just want some type of new beginning. Like this person wants to start over, like completely start over. If you're going on a, and for some of you guys, if you guys had a vacation planned, 
and you guys are like broken up but still going on the vacation it looks like it's going to bring you guys closer together because you guys will have some alone time and you guys will be able to talk things through if not i feel like they're going to offer you like a vacation they're going to offer to take you somewhere it's like they want to travel with you or go somewhere at a distance it could be in the same city or state but i feel like they want to like get a nice hotel and maybe like wine and dine you or like take you on vacation or Whoever this is, is like they want to do something out of the norm, like something that they're not used to doing or something that they never did before. Why is the devil here? The four of swords, the temperance. Yeah. See, they want to lay things to rest with you. Four of swords. So they don't want any more issues. They don't want any more confrontation. They just want you guys to both like heal and find balance and be on the same page. Or this person has been healing. Or they're hoping that you are healing or have healed. And like I said, we have temperance. They definitely want some type of reconciliation. You could be dealing with a Sagittarius as well. Let's see, do they want to get back together? We have the Tower. We have the Seven of Cups. We have the Moon. So this is your energy, Pisces. Um, The Moon could be your energy, our Cancer energy. And we have the Tower here. So there definitely was a separation. There definitely was a breakup. And we have the Seven of Cups. It was due to a lot of confusion, them not knowing what they want. This person could have been a player, could have had other suitors here, could have been like online dating. You kept catching them up because we have the Moon here. So the relationship just kept going through phases and cycles. Yeah, see the five of pentacles, like you guys will break up, get back together, break up, get back together with the five of pentacles and the moon. But it's like with the tower, I feel like they want to come back together and build something solid this time. Yeah, see the page of pentacles. This would have been you guys arguing in the past a lot. So like getting back together, arguing, ending it. Getting back together, arguing, ending it. So with the page of pentacles, they want to make some type of offer. Okay, and they want it to lead to this ten of pentacles because the ten of pentacles is how, is how they feel about you. So the page of pentacles is like they want some type of solid foundation. Okay, the old foundation, it didn't work out because there, there wasn't no stability. Like you guys weren't building it on a solid foundation. And it was because they were confused. So whoever this was, even though they loved you and you guys had some type of relationship, they still had questions in the back of their head about this relationship. You guys see the death card. It needed to go through some type of transformation. You guys could have been dealing with a Scorpio. But if not, it's like there needed to be some ending here. So that if you guys do come back together, there can be a new beginning. And you guys can start over clean slate. The Page of Pentacles, them giving you an offer, rebuilding things, coming out of the old cycle. You know, and it's like even when they did put you through these phases and cycles and left you feeling left, or you felt left out in the cold by them or however they treated you or did you. It's like with this Five of Pentacles here in the moon, that wasn't their true feelings, you know. I feel like this was just some type of, I'm not going to say some type of illusion here, but... Whoever you guys were dealing with, they just had a lot of feelings and they covered them up or hid them or, yeah, they definitely did. We have the Queen of Wands here. See, there was a lot of passion, a lot of chemistry. See, the King and Queen of Wands, this was you guys. And there was a lot of love. There was a lot of chemistry. There was passion there. The Queen of Cups, that's your energy, Pisces. They were in love with you. For some of you guys, it was someone else that confused them. Connor said, sorry, guys. But, yeah, we do have the Five of Pentacles. So, for some of you, I just feel like this person was confused, okay? Pisces, because this is you. They did have feelings for you, but they also have feelings for someone else. But then, let me see. Oh, we have Judgment, yeah. They had needed to make some type of final decision for some of you guys. So, this person kind of was a player. But for others of you, I just feel like this is how they see you, the Queen of Wands and the Queen of Cups. You know, someone that was beautiful, bold, courageous, had it going on. They were in love with you. You know, putting the Queen of Cups and the Queen of Wands together. You know, they see that you were devoted and honest and true to them, Queen of Cups. You know, you took action, Queen of Wands. There was passion there. But with the moon, I feel as if they didn't believe it. Like, it was, like, too good to be true. So, put yourself in some type of illusion. So, I take that back. They're, they probably could have created their own illusion or, like, you know, was lost in their head here with the moon, but like lost in the sense of like knowing they have feelings for you, knowing that this was a real relationship, knowing that there was a connection there, but just not believing that, okay, I got all of this in this person or this person offers and gives me all of this, you know, but then, like I said, for some of you guys, there was someone else. All right, Pisces. So that is your mini case of the ex a reading. I love you guys, and I will talk to you guys again soon. If you guys want to book a personal reading with me, all my information is below. All right, Pisces. I love you. Bye.